Okay. Hello everybody. Today we're going to be focusing on rotation, so your twist. So turning the spine right, turning the spine left. And what this does is, is it helps you bring mobility into the, into the spine because normally we're either leaning back or leaning forward. Usually we, we don't do right and left actions in class. So today that is our focus. Let's get started by sitting in a comfortable seat. Sitting up nice and tall, shoulders away from the ears. Just closing your eyes here for a couple of rounds, couple of rounds of breath. Feeling the breath come into your body, deep belly breathing here. Noticing how the breath can help the muscles relax. Take one more round, a deep inhale in, and a nice full exhale out. Slowly opening the eyes. Interlace the fingers, push the palms forward for a full stretch. Now take the arms over your head. Exhale, arms on by your side. Two more like this. Interlace, stretch forward. Arms come up and circle the arms back. One last one. Interlace and circle it open. One more time. Interlace, stretch forward. Bring the arms up and hold here. Now keeping this nice and tall spine, take the right hand to the right side on the floor. Left arm comes up into your side stretch. Come back to center. Three more like, two more like this. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, side bend to the right. And back up. One more inhale. Exhale, side stretch. And come back up. Stay here. Left arm comes up. Exhale, twist over towards the right. Now release your left hand to the right knee. Right hand can walk behind your spine. Push into the mat, lift up tall, and then exhale, turn and twist. Try to sit up taller and lean the body a bit more forward as you rotate. Come back to center, take both arms up. Left hand to the left side, right arm reaches up and you side stretch. So chest still facing forward, right sit bone heavy on the floor, coming back up, again reaching up tall, exhale to bend. Should feel the length from the sit bone all the way through the arms and come back up. One more reaching up tall, exhale rotate, ro not rotate, side bend and come back up. Coming in for your twist, right arm reaches up. Exhale, rotate towards the left. Keep your twist. Now release the right hand to your left knee. Left hand behind you on the floor. Push up, lift the spine, exhale, twist. Slowly come back to center. Take both arms up. Exhale, hands to the floor, fold forward. <clears throat> Slowly coming back up. Okay, let's lie flat on your back. <clears throat> Knees into your chest. Now keeping your knees together, let's interlace third hands over the right knee, left leg straight. Place the left leg on the floor, but pull the right knee into your chest. And take a spinal twist. Knee crosses the body over towards the left. Right arm comes out and you open out. So here you get the twist in the body. As you bring the right knee towards the floor, can you ground the right shoulder heavy? Come back to center, 
right knee into your chest and then release hug the left knee in right leg straight now take your spinal twist open the left knee towards the right left arm comes out for your chest stretch for your hip stretch come back to center left knee into your chest and release now bend both knees into your chest okay keeping both knees together make sure the sit bones are scooped underneath so the tailbone can ground heavy into the mat both knees into your chest now let's take that the hands the arms into a cactus shape so elbows in line with the shoulders can you draw the knees into your chest and then lower both knees towards the right but keep the left shoulder on the floor so shoulder takes priority here shoulder stays grounded the knees can come towards the right side come back to center keep the knees together bring the knees over towards the left right shoulder stays heavy right shoulder stays heavy knees stay together good come back to center knees to the right chest opens shoulder stays heavy come back to center good to the left feel the core good feel the stretch a little bit deeper back to center two more rounds knees to the right and center good left shoulders still stay heavy center last round knees to the right good back to center knees to the left center good hold here now straighten both legs up towards the ceiling keep the legs straight let's lower your left leg towards the floor interlace the hands behind the right shin and try to draw the leg closer towards you so opening up the hamstrings here keeping this can you lift the shoulder blades off the floor try to bring the forehead towards your knee as you walk the hands up and switch left leg comes up right leg lowers Try to draw the forehead towards the knee. Walk that and hands up your legs. And switch. Good, and switch. For three. Switch. Neck is up high, so looking up towards the ceiling. Keep switching. And switch. Last two. And switch. Last one. Good, and switch, hold here. Both knees into your chest and slowly release back down, rest. So if you're feeling neck in that pose, not pose, but exercise, when you lift the head up, try to think head back. So we want to be looking up towards the ceiling and we don't want to be putting too much strain in, in, in your neck. We want it to come more from the core. So make sure that the neck is in correct alignment so we don't put too much strain on it. Okay, now stretch both legs up towards the ceiling, keeping this. Now shoulder blades heavy on the floor. Take the arms into a T shape. So arms out towards the sides, body is centered. Both legs up towards the ceiling. You can have your palms facing down. So you're sorry wait palms facing up so the shoulders want to rotate outwards keeping this stretch both legs up towards the ceiling and then keeping the feet squeezing together lower your legs towards the right but the left shoulder stays heavy good come back to center legs to the left right pelvis can lift off the floor but right shoulder stays heavy come back to center to the right good come back to center so the pelvis can lift but the shoulders want to stay heavy to the left 
Good, back to center. Few more rounds, you should start to feel the side core to the right. Back to center, to the left. And center, one more round to the right. Good, and center, to the left. And center, very nice, bend the knees. Hug the knees into your chest and rest. Slowly rolling up. Take the feet into a cross leg position. Both arms come up. Inhale, reach up tall. Exhale, hinge forward. Walk the fingertips over towards the right. Gently releasing the upper body down. Come back to center. Fingertips to your left. Come back to center. And coming all the way up, take the arms overhead. Inhale, exhale, release. Two more like this. Inhale, exhale, release. Last one. Inhale, and exhale, release. That is it for today. Thank you for joining me on the mat.